Today, I attempt to trade for Tom Brady in every Madden he's ever been in. Starting in Madden 2001, dude, he was so bad, he didn't even have a face or a name. So we'll put Brady in the trade, or quarterback number 12, technically speaking. I'm gonna try Kevin Daff for Tom Brady. It looks like they're interested. And I would expect with the click of a button, the Patriots have accepted your trade. Tom Brady is now a Tennessee Titan. This might seem easy at first, but imagine how hard it'll be to trade for once he gets to a 99 overall. And for each Madden, I can't get a Brady deal done. I have to give away a copy of Madden 23 to one of my lucky subscribers in the comment section below. On to Madden 2002. He went down? EA did not like this guy. Should make him extremely easy to trade for though. Hilarious enough, I'm trying to bring him over to the Jets. Like, what about a 53 overall quarterback for Tom Brady? <laughs> I mean, that's fair. We did this bad quarterback, and we also threw in this 43 overall fullback. Still not enough. How about on top of the 53 rated quarterback, we go with this 57 rated left guard, submit this through, and it has been accepted. Tom Brady, crazy enough, is now a New York Jet. On to Madden 2003. Oh my god, he's actually got a face and a rating above 50? He's probably gonna be so hard to trade for, though. How about our quarterback straight up? I mean, that's fair. What about a Plaxico Burris in the deal as well. Come on! All three of these guys, they're playing hardball. I mean, it's just Tom Brady, only the greatest quarterback of all time. How about our left guard 93 rate and also throw in somebody like Aaron Smith submit this through? They have accepted your trade! I was so afraid that I was already gonna have to start giving away money and he hasn't even got to a 99 overall yet. Next up, Madden 04, where the legend of Michael Vick began. Bro, he's probably gonna be so hard to trade for here as a 90. Now, we do have somebody like Brett Favre here that we can just trade away straight up like I have no idea we'll submit it through it was accepted easy just like that Tom Brady is a Packer next up Madden 05 well, this was a nice little fancy franchise menu change he's a 95 now it's just gonna get harder and harder I haven't messed with any draft picks yet so what if we went with our starting quarterback and also threw in our first round selection we'll submit this through of course our quarterback our first and second round pick they still didn't accept let's throw in this big defensive tackle please Patriots accept what will it take oh my god we have Derek Brooks bro this better be enough what do you mean bro hold on can I trade for Mike Vrabel at the same time my Tennessee Titans head coach they accepted with the click of the button I got Tom Brady in the Tennessee Titans head coach I think this trade would be what you'd like to call foreshadowing on to Madden 2006 main menus are starting to look fancier at least can your overall quit increasing please we're gonna try to bring Tom Brady over to the Baltimore Ravens but in return for Ray Lewis will submit this through? Like, what do you mean? To comply, we threw in their backup middle linebacker. Also, to throw in a first round selection, we'll submit this through, of course. We need these bars to turn green. Is it really gonna take Ray Lewis and Ed Reed, whose value's only a C, even though he's a 99 overall? What if we threw our quarterback in as well, so they are getting a quarterback in return? And now, throw in our first round selection. There's green interest, please. Patriots accept. Let's go! A high overall, Tom gets the more stressed I get. On to Madden 07. Quit going up! Eventually a trade's gonna be impossible. I just know it. Now interesting enough, I'm gonna throw in Michael Vick into this trade. Like what if I just traded two quarterbacks, dude? They're both decent. I wouldn't want to trade Tom either. Okay, work done added to the trade. The interest went up a little bit. Maybe if we throw in a little draft pick action, our first round selection, it's not green yet. We'll try it anyway. Stingy. We got our cornerback here. 93 rated Dante Hall. It's green interest. Stupid rules to even things up with Erwin Poteet? Like, where do last names even come from, bro? Please, hopefully my hypothesis is correct. Let's go! That's the highest rated Brady that we've traded for yet. Another dub. Next up, Madden 08. Bro, why does the franchise menu look like it was made in Microsoft Paint? Please, Tom, don't be up to a 99 overall. Close enough. I swear the trade menu's been the same for the past 10 years. We have a young Tony Romo that we could throw in. Look at the difference in those evaluations. Maybe we take a Romo L. I guess we start off with Terrell Owens. Bro, our top two rated players both have D plus value. How is this even gonna be possible? We have to abort mission with the Cowboys. I've came to the conclusion the only way we're getting Tom Brady is if we have a high overall quarterback to trade in return. And they were not liking Tony Romo at all. 
Hopefully the Bengals can be our savior. I forgot how many offensive weapons they used to actually have. Carson Palmer's a 97 overall. Already a bit more promising. And they've got to want Chad Johnson, right? Bill Belichick loved him. We submit this through. Ugh. How about both our star receivers? Oh my god, the magical green squares appeared. Please, bro. I'm so tired of this. Please, oh please, oh please save me. Let's go Cincinnati. There's a reason Bill Belichick once said, we're on to Cincinnati. On to the last Madden of the decade. Franchise mode finally looks completely different. <laughs> Nine years later. Oh god, this is the year he joined the 99 club. How hard is he gonna be to trade for now? Freaking Tom. I am not looking forward to this one. At least we got a completely different trade screen though. Drew Brees, he's got to be added into this trade. He's only a C plus value. Interest is kind of up though, so like why not try? It was a waste of time. I mean, could we get away with like a first round pick added into the deal submit this through? Boo! We got to be getting close though. Like what about this guy? Jonathan Vilma. The Saints captain plus Drew Brees in a first round pick. Let's go! Tom Brady is now a new Orleans Saint. Now on to a new decade. Please be a lower overall. Please be a lower overall. Yes! Be easier please. Now in Madden 2010 I want to try to finesse a little bit and see if we can get away with trading a lower overall to get Tom Brady since he's down two overall from last year. Like what about a 69 overall nice. quarterback? Your interest is decent. Trade was accepted! <laughs> you guys just got finesse. Another funky franchise menu. Trying to bring Tom where he wanted to be all along and that's the Dolphins. I mean this probably will take some sort of miracle. So we have Chad Pennington in the deal. If we go ahead and throw in a first round draft pick, their interest is high. It can't be that easy. Seems my hypothesis was correct. But since their interest is high, then we've got to be able to throw in one of our high overall players, right? Ronnie Brown, OG running back. And just like that, simple as you'd like. I know Tom's a happy man right now. Next up, Madden 11. What in the world happened to Tom? He's now down to a 95. At least for me, that's a good thing. Like, Brett Favre's got to be 95 years old at this point. Their interest is high, though. Like, I imagine they actually accept this. I mean, that's fair again. But what else on top of a 40-year-old Brett Favre will it take to bring in the best quarterback of all? time. We added in a first. It doesn't look like that interest bar went up at all, but we'll try it. <gasps> I mean, I'm pretty sure at this point a 99 rated Jared Allen might be enough to kind of tip the scale. Might as well try it. It still didn't look like it moved, dude. Not this lame excuse again. Does that mean that we can Mickey Mouse that and bring in like a 69 rated player and also have this deal be accepted? Oh my god, boys, Tom Brady's a Viking. I mean, you think about it, that did seem like a lot to trade away. But when you think about it, it's Tom Brady. If I was Bill, I would have asked for another five first round picks. This this would mean prime Tom Brady would be handing the ball off to prime Adrian Peterson. Bet you guys are thankful I'm not a real GM. On to Madden 12. This is the weirdest franchise menu I've ever seen. Like, dude, who designed this? A frog? There's no way he kept going down in overall, right? You've got to be kidding me. That is what I'd like to call intimidation. Gonna try a straight up swap. Philip Rivers of the Chargers for Tom Brady. Like, obviously, I feel like this isn't gonna be accepted straight up, but this might bring us kind of close. Like, is it as simple as adding in a little dare? and Sproles action. Patriots don't like Darren. Like, I do want to play around with the trade logic a little bit. Like, can I throw in a little crappy Malcolm Floyd? He's not crappy. 80 overall. Disrespectful I am. Submit this into the universe. They said no. Uh, what else can we add to the trade? Wait, is that the subscribe button? Click it, please, so the Patriots will accept this trade. So, Corey was a rookie. For some reason, his overall has a question mark behind it, so I'm curious. So, I'm gonna submit him into the trade and see if that question mark was magical and the answer, once again, was no. This is starting to prove to be quite the test. Bro, are you gonna make me give away my 99 rated Antonio Gates on top of all this? I feel like that interest bar stayed the exact same since the beginning. Does that mean I can Mickey Mouse in a Myron Pryor? We might be a click away, boys, and we are! Tom Brady for Phillip Rivers and Antonio Gates. Now on to Madden 13. It might just be me, but the Madden 13 main menu to me is like the most nostalgic. Oh wow, all the way down to a 93? So my stress levels have lowered just a tad. Oh, it took me five hours to even find where you trade players. So why is it locked? Like, do I have to purchase something to unlock trades? I'm trying to bring Tom Brady to the team that he always dreamed of playing for. What would happen if we offered two quarterbacks? They don't want either, but I'll try it anyway. What the frick is this, bro? Like, what do you mean? Just a big waste of my freaking time. Like, could you have just told me this a minute ago? Screw it. We're just literally gonna go all out and put all our ammo on the board at once. Patrick Willis, let's also throw in one of our other high overall players and almost out of his prime Frank Gore. But keep in mind, Tom Brady at this point 35. Many people at this point thought he was washed and was just gonna get worse. Little did they know. I do kind of like the color-coded interest meters. That's kind of fancy. But on top of those two superstars, if we also go in and throw in our number 
one overall pick. We're gonna submit this through, and please, man, don't make me do this again. That's what I like to call a massive dub. Interested to see if enough people complained and got this feature taken out for the next year, which welcomes us into Madden 25. Anything but a 99, bro, seriously. That's just a massive L. This definitely looks like the more modern trade menu that we're used to today. Now, does that mean it's actually gonna become more difficult to trade for Tom? Imagine a straight-up Eli Manning for Tom Brady trade. Holy crap, dude, this would be historical. I don't think it would have gone over too well if Bill would have made this trade. We can try, though, a super young Jason Pierre Paul. I also want to throw in Victor Cruz because it's going to take a lot because he's a 99. It's worth the shot. We'll submit it through. This message doesn't seem too promising. Like, is the first round pick enough? I don't know. We'll submit this bad boy through. Please, brother, let's go. Oh, my God. No way. This is the most ridiculous quarterback room I've ever seen. On to Madden 15. At this point, bro, I'm content if he doesn't come in at a 99 overall. Huh? Bro, that's like the lowest overall he's been since his fourth season. What the frick did Tom to to warrant such a downgrade? He threw for 4,100 yards, 33 touchdowns, and 9 picks in 2014. What is EA smoking? Russell Wilson's 5 overall higher than Tom Brady. There's just no way this goes through straight up. Is it this simple? It's really not what I expected. It's gotta be close, though. Like, maybe a little addition of, like, a Marshawn Lynch. Okay, this has got to be accepted. This is a huge offer. Like, imagine the scenes this trade goes down in real life after this this Super Bowl happens. Submit this through. What do you mean? Not willing to give you one of my top dogs just yet. Like, will this second round pick tilt the needle? And it does! Like, to be honest, for the Patriots, that was a pretty decent return. Madden 16's next up. There's no way his overall got any lower. Yeah, all the way up to 98. I know we haven't had to give away a copy of Madden 23 yet, but trust me, the trade logic gets more and more complicated and stupid. Like, I do just kind of for the giggles want to include 39-year-old 84 overall Peyton Manning in this trade trade. They don't want him at all, so that might be a stumbling block. Good to take him off our hands. We'll go ahead and throw a 99 overall Von Miller. They want him. Come on, bad boys. Accept this one, Robert. <laughs> Come on, Bill. We're gonna give you a stack defense. All we want is the best quarterback of all time in return. I think the problem is they just don't want Peyton the grandfather. We'll replace Peyton with a second round selection submitted through, and that one was accepted. Here we come, Madden 17. Why does he keep bouncing up and down and overall like this? Like, it's Tom Brady ready, bro. Just keep him at a 99. Make it simple. Ooh, so as the Colts, we have a young, promising quarterback, Andrew Luck, just a few years before he retired. They do want him, so will they trade the older guy for the younger stud submitted through? Hey, this is the first time we got a trade meter. That is a promising start, but we have a little bit more work to do. Let's trade away Vontae Davis before he retires at halftime. So an odd trade, a guy that retires in a few years and a guy that retired at halftime eventually. <laughs> They're too expensive. We might have to actually take Andrew Luck out of this deal. It's gonna be hard for them to accept without getting a good quarterback in return. We'll try the first round pick in our other highest overall player, which is T.Y. Hilton. If this doesn't go through, we might have to work some magic. Please, brother, accept this one. That's a dub. I was actually kind of worried. On to Madden 18. Well, would you look at who's on the next cover? I'm gonna start paying attention to this because I'm extremely curious to see how his kind of trade value is the next few years, even if his overall is good, like, you know, a 99 and even if he's on the cover. But now that he's 40, will that lower his trade value? Now, I still expect him to cost a ton because he's a 99, but we have a 99 of our own, Aaron Donald. What do you mean they're not interested? Dude, it's Aaron Donald. Dumb game. I'm just going to try it anyway, submit it through. Like, what do you mean, bro? One star? Gosh, dang, maybe it's going to take all these guys. Lamarcus Joyner and Todd Gurley submitted that one into the universe, and it's looking better. There's no way that Jared Goff is going to be the one to seal the deal for Tom. Like, there's just no way they're replacing Tom Brady with Jared Goff. Oh, smart boys. Now, curious, are they value a first round pick over Jared Goff? And the answer to that is a big yes. 40 years old or not, that's an absolute criminal return. Coming up on Madden 19, there's no way he was 99 again. Well, He's 41, though, so Patriots cut me some slack. I really don't have too much ammo here. Derrick Henry was an 86. Marcus Mariota was an 80, but I don't think that's enough. I mean, I'll throw it out there. Boys, we could have a huge problem. I've saved my money up to this point, but it's not looking good. We might have to abort mission on the Titans. We'll try a first-round pick thrown in this thing. <laughs> 
I'm scared. So instead, just our best three players. They don't even want two of them. Like, bro, he's 41. What do you mean? Bro, who even has the ammo that I need? Maybe Pittsburgh's the answer. Big Ben throwing in the deal and trading away this Madden's cover athlete. He was a 99 himself. So like a 99 receiver with an old aging quarterback who's decent still. Oh no. Bro, what can I even do? Like, this has got to be juicy to you, Bill. No? That's three five-star players. Why all of a sudden as a 41-year-old, dude? We're boarding mission again. Aaron Rodgers is the only other 99 rated QB. Like the Packers are really my only hope. Come on, Bill. He's younger than Tom. He's the same Madden rating as Tom. That should be an easy decision, right? Oh my god, obviously not. Aaron Rodgers in a first round pick, please, bro. Did that even budge? Like what the frick do you want from me? I'm having to finesse now. Got the number one pick and the number two pick. Like if this doesn't work, I don't know what will. I just beg. I just beg. Like what the frick? This is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. I made these three guys all 99 overall 20-year-old rookies. This literally will confirm that this is impossible. I'll submit this through. I just chalk this one up as an L. I really thought I was going to get out of this without losing any money. Why am I getting punished for this, dude? Like, how is this my fault? On to Madden 20. Wait, are they really advertising Madden 23 on the Madden 20 menu? Pathetic. Oh, thank God he's been bumped down. Hopefully Madden 20 simpler. I have a bullet proof plane and that bulletproof plane is Patrick Mahomes. He's 99 rated and bro, this has got to be accepted, right? What do you mean? This is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. We're getting somewhere and hopefully Tyreek Hill is just enough. I actually beg that it is. It's close though. Are we really about to have to throw in the trio of dreams for a 91 overall 43 year old? I just hope that this is enough. Stupid! The first overall selection better be enough. Bro, if this doesn't get accepted, I'm moving into the freaking forest. Thank God I get to enjoy the comfort of my home. Like, still though, that's ridiculous. Madden 21 be easy on me. Bro, I forgot. He's a buck now. Bro, thank God this is our first time not having to deal with the stingy Patriots. I want to try cover athlete for Tom Brady straight up. Come on, bro. He's like 69 years old at this point. Just accept it. That was so much simpler than the past few Maddens. I'll take simple in this stressful world. We've made it to Madden 22. And look who graces our presence on the Madden cover again. This is actually the first time I can upgrade this skill tree and make the trade for Tom Brady even easier. So you best bet I'm using everything I possibly can. How the frick as a 45 year old do you go back up in overall? Exactly why I spent my valuable time using those upgrades. Even though he's way lower in overall, Josh Allen for a 45 year old Thomas. I have a sneaky suspicion this isn't going to be close. Okay. I mean as the Buccaneers, that's a pretty smart decision. And we're not done just yet. We finally made it to Madden 23. Now I have to say this has got to be one of the coolest Madden loading screens I've ever seen. In what could be his final Madden ever, Tom comes in as a 97 overall. We've literally gone from our early 20s Tom Brady to a 45 year old Tom. And honestly I feel like EA was a little generous in his speed ratings. And I only thought it was fair that we bring him back to where it all started. What's it going to take for the 45 year old 97 rated Tom? Like how about a straight up Mac Jones for Tom Brady trade? This would actually be so hilarious. We're gonna submit this through and that does not look promising at all. Like, did we just try our three highest rated players submit this through? It's not even out of the red yet. We literally went out and acquired the number one overall pick just like that. Come on, this is at least gotta be like halfway, right? I mean, not really. We're a boarding mission. Tom Brady told me he didn't want to be a Patriot. Bringing him to San Francisco where he always wanted to play. We have a 99 rated Trent Williams we're gonna try to throw out there and that's looking promising. We also throw in George Kittle how close does this get? I mean, it's in the orange. That's the best it's been so far. We don't have a first round draft pick from this year. How about our first from next year? Is that enough to see this through? No. Do I literally just have to go with my next highest rated player, Nick Bosa? Like, this has got to be enough, right? You've got to be kidding. Got the number one pick back from the Patriots. Now, if this is not enough, I don't know if this thing is even possible. I think, once again, it went down, dude. I think I might need a quarterback in return to trade away for Tom Brady. There's no way it's gonna have to take Pat Mahomes Holmes, right? If this doesn't get accepted straight up, this game is absolutely stupid. This game actually isn't stupid. That's not what I wanted to do, but that's what we had to do because we have now officially traded for Tom Brady in every single Madden he's ever been in. And I only have to give away one copy to a subscriber in the comments. Now, if you enjoyed that one, click right here to watch me score a touchdown with Tom Brady in every Madden he's ever been in.